Hello everyone, thanks for watching. In this video, you will see the lights that I use. I will show you my LED lights and my CFL lights that I use. And uh, yeah, enjoy. Hello everyone, thanks for watching and I'm back with the CFL lights that I use I've put them all together over here as you can see um, let's start over here over here you see this one the 23 watt you also see 103 watt on the packaging and I see some people on YouTube that mention the 103 watts and say yeah I'm going with a 103 watt bulb but that's not the case it's only um, to explain um, how much it puts out compared to older light bulbs so what is important is this the lumen 1450 uh, the brand is Philips and yeah they make uh, very good lights uh, masters of lightning how I like to call them <laughs> but um, 1450 uh, amounts of lumen it's pretty good for a 23 watt uh, light bulb and as you can see uh, it has a straight form um, let me get it out so you can see it a bit better and yeah you see it's uh, see the color code 2700k warm white you also have cold uh, white it's uh, for the grow stage and it's actually for the flowering stage but yeah I use them for the whole grow process that's not a big deal but uh, yeah you see uh, you see them over here um, see if elbows uh, get pretty hot um, but that's why I use smaller ones I also have a big one over here you see here you see here uh, 32 watts and if you look at the form it's very big let me uh, take this out so you can see and I'm back and oh yeah one thing uh, if you like this video if you if it is any useful please like please subscribe uh, I really love to make these videos and uh, yeah look at the difference these two um, one thing they put out uh, um, an enormous amount of lightning um, if you look at the amount of lumen more than 2200 lumen that's, uh, that's a lot of lumen but also it gets more hot than this one um, if you know when um, the sea of Albop is on it gets pretty hot and this is the yeah one of the strongest ones so it gets yeah super hot and w when you're using one it's important to keep it as close as possible to the plant um, that's just the only thing you need to know when you use them just place them as close as possible just watch out that you don't burn the plant um, a cannabis plant grows very fast so you need to uh, set the lights at the correct distance almost every day when you grow with CFL lights that's an important step and yeah that's uh, those are the important things um, yeah you can buy them almost everywhere 
uh, yeah just when you are buying check for the most watts and you also see I have a 14 watt it's even smaller and I can use that in the summer when uh, it's more hot uh, I use less watts so it doesn't get too hot in the growth space and I'm back everyone with the LED lights that I use as you can see this one is very big compared to this one if you look over here you see that the bulbs the, are very small and if you look at this one this um, LED light really puts out some serious power uh, you can easily use this in a um, uh, beer grow space uh, to uh, give the plant some extra light or if you have two you can uh, grow um, a very big plant uh, in my opinion mix it up with uh, some CFL bulbs but uh, le let me get back to my situation um, yeah this is um, the LED light that I prefer um, it is a small small one but um, because um, I grow in a small place micro grow PC grow um, when, when you use LED lights they need to to, uh, to be at the correct distance with uh, like I said with CFL bulbs you just place them as close as possible but with uh, LED lights it's a whole other story um, you need to place them at the correct distance um, with a light like this when the plant is small it is uh, more, more than 30 centimeters maybe even more and when the plant is a bit bigger you can put it a bit closer but yeah when you're growing in a small place a lot of the times you don't have that space so when you do that uh, grow in a small place sometimes these beautiful lights can do more harm than good and yeah that's uh, that's not a good thing they can um, get light burn I have a whole video about that on my YouTube page you can check it out um, they, they put on some serious power and um, uh, can give some serious beautiful grow but um, because of the purple color uh, some of the times you don't see it at the right time that you have yeah that goes too fast that you have uh, light burn and with this um, small LED light um, you just place them pretty close uh, not too close uh, depending on uh, how, how big the plant is so um, yeah, these uh, these lights you uh, just you can uh, put them pretty close, um, but I gotta mention even with this small LED lights, um, you can get light burn. For example, um, when I uh, started the grow, I thought I just put one of these small LED lights uh, above the plant. Um, some. some um, a pretty big distance uh, because uh, I just germinated them so I had the whole space in the PC box that I use so it was um, a pretty big distance between the light and the plant but even with this small LED light it caused a uh, light burn in a way that the plant didn't grow any uh, further I um, also have a video about that on my YouTube page you will see that I uh, used this from the beginning and the plant just didn't uh, grow anymore because it was too much for the little uh, little plant so yeah even with this you can get light burn but when the plant is big it can handle more and yeah the, these are uh, very uh, come in very handy but of course they aren't very big um, compared to, an, uh, to a lighter 
but that <laughs> that also comes in handy when you are growing a small place because they are very small so you can put them um, in a corner and um, yeah uh, uh, let the space for your plant so the plant can uh, grow and develop beautiful buds because yeah when you're using a CFL like this one yeah you uh, you really uh, get you really get, uh, lose a lot of space um, with a big light like this compared to a small light like this you have a lot of space for the plant so yeah that's um, uh, the lights that I use and I've got to mention when I bought this small LED light um, I saw that there were two kinds because uh, when I bought the, f bought the first two um, I was very happy and then I bought another one but then I discovered that it didn't have the same build quality um, so you have different kinds that look the same like this I have a link on my uh, website uh, picture you can click on the picture intelligentstoner.com and you can buy it at Amazon over there um, so yeah that's a thing I want to mention also and uh, on my website I also have a uh, link you can buy this uh, LED light um, a, a smaller uh, smaller one but also a bigger one I have um, links from uh, of the products that I use on my website and yeah you can check that out and what I also need to mention is that when I um, bought the LED lights I did that because I know that has the, they had some uh, really good um, um, power to uh, uh, grow the cannabis plants uh, but uh, another reason was because um, they get less hot um, I knew this and they indeed get less hot but yeah this um, LED light is um, around uh, 20 watts um, and yeah it really gets super hot I think it is the same um, just like an um, this one uh, 23 uh, watt CFL maybe even uh, close to this one the bigger uh, CFL bulb the, uh, this uh, this LED light gets really hot but like I said it puts out some serious power so if you have um, a bigger grow space a small grow tent uh, like you can see on my website um, or you you go in the closet or something like that you can be, you can be very creative with the grow spaces then yeah the, the, this light will amazing it can give you serious plants big plants of course you want to have uh, big lights big lights more watts uh, equals a big harvest but it's not always possible um, you, you need to check what's suitable and for small grow places lights like this are amazing you can use it is always better to use small lights uh, multiple small lights instead of a big light I did that I started with two uh, 33 watt uh, CFL bulbs but um, they use a lot of space and in the beginning it was okay but they get uh, also really hot so yeah it just wasn't working and, and I uh, use these smaller ones uh, so whole difference uh, because they are straight you can put them uh, on the top of the grow space um, you can see they aren't um, very uh, uh, big so if you put them on the top sideways like this they don't use a lot of space and these one also don't use a lot of space so that's why I really love these small ones I have the links on my website and yeah I think I've told everything about my uh, grow lights um, I hope you enjoyed it I hope you it was uh, informative and uh, yeah thanks for watching everyone I hope you enjoyed the video I hope it was any uh, helpful informative 
let me know if you have any questions um, the lights that I use weren't expensive especially the CFL bulbs but um, the LED lights aren't expensive also um, you can check that out on my website intelligencestoner.com um, yeah I hope you like this video I will uh, post new videos every week like I always do and uh, yeah thanks everyone peace